<laughs> Can you talk about how much the, the experience you got last year is helping you going into the springs compared to last year when you first started? Um, it helped a lot. You know, now I, I, I know, I expect, you know, what, what's going to happen this year, you know. Um, just getting familiar with, you know, how to play football more. You know, in high school, you know, you don't really figure that stuff out until you get here and, you know, the experience of coaches and stuff. So it helps out a lot. You know, I think it's going to benefit me a lot this year. You got so much praise from your teammates about your work ethic last year, but what were your expectations when you came in for, for the past season? Um, just anything to help. You know, I, I was a young guy. I didn't really expect to play a lot or, you know, I just expected to just try to help as much as I could, you know, whatever they could use me for. So that was about it. Was it like a whirlwind for you last year coming in and then playing a lot right away? Kind of overwhelming a little bit. Yeah, it was. Um, but you know, there's really nothing you can do about it. You just just try to do your best and you know, not worry about any negatives. Just stay positive. And just do what you can. Did you, how much work are you getting to do in taking single back sets? You know, Muschamp mentioned that as a possibility. When you back there by yourself, how much work are you doing that this spring? Yeah, um, just a little bit so far. You know, we're still just trying to uh, install some basics, kind of basic offense and stuff. So we haven't got too crazy yet. So, you know. Where do you see? Where do you see your role? Um, as as you know, a lead blocker. You know, um, a lot of special teams and just. Almost the same as last year, but maybe a little more. Is that what you want? Is that where you feel like you're <coughs> Yeah, you know, I, I feel like that's that's the reason why I'm here. So, you know, the, so. It's kind of hope that develops. It's like a lot of fullbacks in the NFL mm -hmm. pass it out of the backfield. Yeah, yeah, kind of yeah, stuff, yeah. Like a John Cooper yeah. Green Bay, you kind of hoping it develops into that. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, that'd be nice. You know, just it would just help me out. You know, just, you know my draft stock would <laughs> in the league one day, maybe. You know. <laughs> So it just shows I could do more than you know a couple things that makes me a little, a little versatile. So that, you, you, you could, if they needed you, so you could carry it 15, mm -hmm. 18 times in a game, right? No problem. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I was pretty much a running back all through high school, so I mean, that's usually what I'm used to. Uh, you know, I'm just trying to still transition to blocking and all that stuff. So, so yeah, I think. Have you talked to Coach White about that? Like, hey, I could get 15, uh, 20 carries here for you. No, I'm really hurting, you know, or you want some. They seem like they know what they're doing. You know, we got some pretty good running backs, so I'm not gonna. Going all that. What kind of player though does it take to come in and say, you know, I, this is what I did in high school and I was really good at it, but I'm willing to take on this new role? Um, just trying to be a team player and do what's best for the team. Um, you know, just I, I really don't care about all this stuff now. I just really care about winning. You know, just getting back up to where we, where they were in the past couple of years. So. It's just something I just go ahead and do. What's what's something that we may not know about you? Maybe your teammates may not know. About you. Something interesting about you. To be honest, I have no idea. I'm a pretty. What's your favorite football team? NFL. Uh, Tampa Bay Bucks. Bucks, yeah, from that area. So, try to stick with them. Is there any difference?